small community in Northern Virginia is in shock tonight. Four people were found shot to death inside a house on Mansfield Court in Woodbridge. Police have a person of interest in custody. News 4's Darcy Spencer is live on the scene tonight with the latest on the investigation. Darcy? Well, Sean, Prince William County Police are still here tonight conducting that investigation, and you can get an idea just from looking behind me. This is a very quiet residential neighborhood. The chief of police told us earlier tonight that this was a very challenging scene for his officers to go inside that house and find multiple bodies. One victim was found in the kitchen. Loved ones gathered waiting for news outside the home where four people, two men and two women, were found shot to death. I'm really shocked because, like, this is a pretty safe neighborhood and, like, things like this don't really happen here. Prince William County Police say they believe the victims knew each other and they knew the man taken into custody described as a person of interest. He's being questioned in connection with the shootings. A viewer provided this photo of a man in handcuffs sitting on a curb nearby as police conducted their investigation. It's, like, crazy to me because, like, I've never seen, like, that amount of, like, police officers. Because, like, earlier, like, a couple hours ago, I saw, like, there was, like, 20 of them over there. Police say the gun used to shoot all four victims was recovered. Officers got the call about 4.30 in the afternoon. The call is now and He's inside of the residence and saying there are somebody dead. There's four people inside. Officers found the victims in different parts of the home. While police did not provide a motive, they say it's domestic. Police officers are human beings. To go into a home like that and to see anyone that has died as a result of gunshot wounds is just traumatic. After making the initial discovery, police left the home to wait for a search warrant. Neighbors and relatives gathered outside hoping to learn more. So far, the victims have not been named. You know, I know the kids in the neighborhood. You know, I deal with the kids a lot. So I was just here to give them a little bit of support and give them my condolence. You know, they're crying. And they're sad. They sure are. You know, I checked in with Prince William County Police a little bit earlier. They tell me there is no update. Still no arrest has been made in connection with these shootings. We are hoping to get more information sometime tomorrow.